Hello, welcome back. Today I'm wanting to talk about the connectivity issues between the mobile phone and the DJI Neo via Wi-Fi, which I recently encountered when I was making my last video about connecting the DJI Neo to my mobile phone using Wi-Fi to manually control the DJI Neo with my phone via Wi-Fi. I hope all that makes sense. If it doesn't, then go back, listen to it over again, and then just watch the rest of the video. So let's crack on. So here I am, happily flying along. The phone's connected to the Neo via the Wi-Fi and using manual controls. I get it up to Max the maximum reach. altitude. And then the screen just, sorry, the screen glitches a little bit here and judders. And if you look in the top right corner when it does that, the Wi-Fi strength indicator drops by one bar. But it comes back and I continue flying until I reach the maximum distance here as well. So I will be at maximum altitude and maximum distance. But during this video, keep an eye on the Wi-Fi strength indicator in the top right corner of the screen. That's quite important um, because that... Reached. There we go, that's us at the max flight distance. That, as you'll see in a second, drops my one bar, goes back up to full, and then the signal just completely drops out. So you get effectively, there we go, signal lost, disconnected from aircraft. So the aircraft's just hovering. There's none I can do at this moment in time. But there was no warning. Max altitude that reached. effectively just, just dropped out without any real warning other than that strength indicator going by down by one bar but to me that would indicate that that's still fairly fairly good signal strength between the the, the phone and the, and the neo reached. so i continue making efforts to reconnect to the drone i try and bring the drone down as as quickly as i possibly can but then i i keep getting these messages from that lovely helpful lady inside the drone saying max distance max reached and then I get these Wi-Fi signal interference messages, signal lost. Max flight the reached. interference messages are strange to me because I'm in a field in the middle of nowhere. There's no Wi-Fi from houses or anything that's going to interfere with the drone. It's a direct line Max of sight between my phone reached. and the Neo. So that poses a bit of a worry as well. Um, I continue making efforts to reconnect to the drone. Initially I don't walk any closer because I can see that it does reconnect automatically without me having to go through this rigmarole here and when it does reconnect the strength bar for the Wi-Fi does look fairly strong. So eventually I give in and after I try landing and it doesn't connect I walk closer to the drone and I do manage to bring the drone down manually. The worry would be for me if you're low on battery and you reached. lose signal and your drone i suppose would do a forced landing in that scenario is it somewhere that's going to be an appropriate place for it to land if not you could find yourself in trouble you could lose your drone it could land on water it could land on a roof you just don't know so i don't know i personally probably will not ever use the wi-fi connection to use between my phone and the drone again. Um, you'll see here that I'm basically right underneath the drone from where it was in the sky. And I do manage to successfully bring it down, but yeah, it's not fantastic. You don't get any real warning in terms of when the signal's gonna drop out. It just goes from full to zero and that's you. So be careful yeah. if you're using this mode and this function. It's not the best, it's not the most reliable. And I certainly will not be using it again and would not recommend it. But thanks for watching in any case.